My name is Dennis Simmons. I'm not sure what I would be doing if it wasn't for this program, what other options I have. Uh, here on the Kratha gas plant, I am a first year electrical apprentice. I'm doing a dual trade, so electrical and instrumentation. Personally, I, th I think it would make a huge difference. For me, um, individually, I haven't really stuck at anything. I've never really known what I wanted to do in life. Um, this is the first time, actually, as much as I've struggled, this is the first time I've actually stuck at something this long and, and actually tried, because I think in the future it'll be better for me. My name is Danae Lane. The training program I'm doing is Cert to Construction Engineering. I'm doing some work experience with three different placements for nine weeks each. Um, it is a good experience to work at here. You meet a lot of people and you enjoy what you do most of the time. So I do encourage a lot of people from my community and everyone around the world to experience it. My name is Ashley Kawang. I'm currently doing a Cert 2 scaffolding traineeship program. Uh, to be honest, if I wasn't in this program, I wouldn't know what I would be doing. In five years' time, hopefully I'd like to see myself in the, as a manager in the scaffolding industry. I think this training has given me a great opportunity to get into the industry. Our trade is a worldwide company, which means we interact with many Indigenous cultures. Here in Australia, we're pleased to be part of the Indigenous engagement process and this year's launch of our Reconciliation and Action Plan, or RAP, showcases uh, our trade's values, particularly that of respect, um, as well as improving the lives of the Indigenous communities. There's good business reasons, though, for us to want to engage on this level in that many of our clients only offer scopes to companies that are mostly owned by Indigenous folk. So over the course of the last year, Altrad has been creating joint ventures with our Indigenous partners around Australia, an example of which is the one that we formed with the um, Yarra Corporation, which allows us to deliver additional services to, to Woodside. At a more individual level, we've taken some young Indigenous folk and introduced them into the gas plant life as traineeships and, and apprenticeships. So together we've had a, a great year in the Indigenous engagement space and we're really looking forward to um, what we can do in the future with, uh, with our clients and uh, particularly with the uh, Indigenous groups. Reconciliation in Australia is a way we can improve relationships between Aboriginal and non-Aboriginal people. Uh, so Reconciliation Action Plans, or RAPs as we call them, is the way that organisations can practically be involved in walking together. And that can be mean things like understanding history, employment opportunities and procurement opportunities.